or you wake in any moon, as him can quit the Azello. As him no bossing Kataya, a man I am. I ask him, I dry no money, okay? Dry no money, only dry no money for. Was I an uncandy bojibiri? No, I dry no ma. No, I did the chin each other, go up. Or try to try to quit it. He said, He said, He said, I do go see the moon name. I yell with a no bossing Katabo, ya bo. No posidio came by from Eastern is twenty four. I see the hotel near Bozi. No posidio came by Bastama Kiyeneme no Bodino Nimia and Bastama Kamuro and Dibona as so. Um, oh, if I told it here to Niba Alpo, a cool gay beef. A man of five years here to Nobon and Cabo Bosizi in a Serena, Eastern is twenty four. Cabaro K join AI and turn on your notification. Kira P. Miss, any of our update, the guy now drop your new rapopo, my Eastern News 24. All right, yeah, be fair, bo, um, Odogu woke yana kwa saima wana yeba, unu moyane kumakia, the commando no mesi, um, his purpose, and, uh, for ma asinam de kano, and to the blood, the people of Biafra. Yeah, be fair, kai jimakia wo yebya, um, yigia ya be fair, Oh, guys! So, who must now go see their honey? We are going to talk about the baby figures. It's a lie alone to give it. But I'm going to be fair. You know, we are going to. All right, over to you. Battle for freedom is not for little livered people. It's not for kids. So, freedom is not. Uh, it's not meant for people that are too emotional. It's not meant for people that uh, you know. Uh, somebody will talk this and talk that, and they begin to shiver. No. I am born for Biafra to come. And I'm going to help Mazinam Dikano to get Biafra. Believe me. Go and mark today's date. I want to assure Biafrans, so long as you continue to stand on your freedom, I will be there for you. So long as you continue to maintain that you have a right to leave, I, Simon Epa, will be there. Any day, any time. Good evening, Assyrians. This is Satla Media. Mr. Opara, let us examine the statement that came from Finland based Biafra agitator. I'm talking about someone else. Having watched a video where he have said that he was born for the purpose of restoring Biafra and again that he's going to help Mazen Nanda Kalu to restore Biafra. Let us get a media reaction before we dive into other areas. You see, but someone like was saying that he was born for the restoration of Biafra. What he says is right. It's exactly his destiny. Going to Finland, doing the training, doing the this, becoming a military man in Finland, become escorted military man in Finland, joining Finland politics, uh, doing everything in Finland, become a Finland nationality. That was exactly the will of God. Finland brought him up as a military man. Finland brought him up as a politician. Finland brought him up as a businessman. All this will be a plan of Finland people to build him up. You know? And uh, 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 and uh, Finland accommodated him. Everything was according to the plan of God. Because if he's in Nigeria, maybe the system of Nigeria will not allow him to actualize his destiny of coming into this world. That's what I'm saying. Because if you look at it, by the time they were about to pull Nam the Talo in surface, without anybody appointing him, without anybody recognizing him, he set up his own platform as one of the medium platform of Biafra, talking of Biafran issue. But nobody knows that he can be able to rise to this rank he is now. This to show you that he walked towards his destiny for the restoration of Biafra. Now, I have said it before. When I quote, when I say, I will quote General de Gaulle of France, former France pre president, even during the Second World War. He said that the war between Nigeria and Biafra have now come to an end. But it was the youth who were not born before the war, generation who were not born before the war, 
will bring the world to an end to their own test as they like it. And if you watch, someone will fall into that category of the people who were not born before the war. They were born after the war. And see what he's doing. Which means by saying, God bring him to this world for the isolation of Biafra, to help Biafra to be, to help the nation of Biafra to be. What he said is right. Look at all the all the ways he followed. What he says is right. It's just like a man moving on the direction of his destiny without knowing that he's moving on the direction of his destiny. Until when he came to realize to himself that he's on the right path. Therefore, he stands family. That is why every criticism, even the one who always criticizes him, the one the uh, evil people criticize him, or unless they criticize him, uh, evil people criticize him, evil people criticize him, even Nigerian government criticize him. He's not moving. It's not, not removing anything about him. Even like call him a terima, call him a, 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 a terrorist, call him a, 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 a troublemaker in the in, in, in Biafra land, south south southeast as they call us. It doesn't move him because he was on the right part of his destiny. It was the right part of why God created him. It doesn't move him. So what he said that I, he was born to help for the restoration of Biafra is his perfect word, his right word. He speaks as a as a as a, 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 a as a prophet. Well, but is that you are saying he speaks as a prophet? Is he that you have uh, understanding from spiritual realm? Or you are just using your instinct to say it. Um, you see, if the spirit of God is in you, he will put, lead you in the right direction. And you speak as a prophet, well, not a prophet. You understand what I'm saying? You will speak as a prophet, well, not a prophet. You will speak, and your word will come to pass. Which means God has put in a gift uh, of wisdom into you, a gift of discernment into you. Do you understand? That's what happened. Okay, but now, looking at the other area he said, where he's saying that so long as uh, Biafrans, the Igbos, remain resolute and believe in the struggle that he's there with them. It means, uh, because the Bible says, can two go together except they agree? Yeah, it actually takes two to tango. It means the people he is leading need to be resolute and ready for him to lead them. And you see, uh, the that's what what we say in the Igbo Igbo adage, "Rigri Uguese," which means the king that is ruling, and have the people that surrender him, have the the, the subjects is ruling. That's the pre prestige or honor of that king. If you're a king and you don't have anybody ruling, your your, your kingship is is is, is, is meaningless. If he's fighting for better restoration, coming out for better restoration, and the people you want to fight for, the people you want to have freedom are not ready. His effort is in vain. Do you know? Sorry, do you know why I'm asking this question? Because by our standard, the Ohanes and Igbo are a subset of the Igbo extraction. They are part of Igbo. And if you are looking at people who he is supposed to be leading, I think the Ohanes and Igbo are supposed to be part of it. But I have a situation where the Ohanes and Igbo have uh, acknowledged federal government that they should extradite Epa from Finland to Nigeria. So, the way it stands, it means. There is a um, crack in the ranks of the Igbos. So how do you think an Eba can manage that situation? A situation where some Igbos, as prestigious as that organization, or how does Igbo call it for its extradition? Do you think it's a setback? Um, not today. Not be today. Not be today. May I tell you the truth? Eh? Those who be a crowd of and Igbo, they are not a and and Igbo. They are Hanes and the Nigeria. That's why they are fighting for Nigeria. That's why they are working for Nigeria. That's why they said the Islamic government should be extracted, extracted, and bring back to Nigeria, not bring back to Biafra, but to Nigeria. When you look at people west, by their feet we shall know them, by their character you shall know where they belong to. And this so so called Hanes and Dibo, how many are they in number? They are not up to five thousand. Or ten thousand people. Okay, let's see. Ten thousand people. They're not uh, up to ten thousand people. They can look at you to compile over eighty to hundred million people that have only agreed to be Biafra. You take them to compile. Even 
Watch the people of Israel. When Moses were leading them, some people, some people rise up. For Jonathan and Abira, rise up and ask David uh, and ask uh, Moses, "Are you the only person? Is it only that God can speak? We are men of renounced men. We are we, we, we are people like you. We, we, after all, all of us are Levites. What happened to them? What happened to them? I don't go mad and swallow them. Two hundred and fifty people have supported them. All of them perish. So it's just like this. One hundred and Igbo. Even Hanes and Igbo, the people they said they are Hanes and the Igbo did they don't recognize them? That, that, do you know that there was a time? Even the one now, I saw Hanes and Igbo. Call for Igbo governors conference. Call problem people in Igbo land for conference. They reject him. They do not go. Is it this type of people can stop Samuel Nepa? Is it this type of people can, can, can stop Biafra? What Samuel Nepa said, the people that knew they are Biafra, the people that are eager for Biafra, that are more than Hannes and Igbo, more than Igbo, Igbo Niger politicians, more than Biafra Nigerian politicians, more than Igbo, uh, uh, Igbo, uh, Igbo, uh, Igbo Tasha rulers Nigeria, more than Biafra Tasha rulers Nigeria. He said, if you are ready, to stand to determine that you'll be free, I will be with you, I will struggle with you, I will do everything with you until you are emancipated and have your own freedom. And the people you dead, look at it at home to show that they are ready. Look at a uh, vote of a referendum of resolution of Biafra, they are ready. Look at the contribution they're doing to keep men on the ground. To show you that they are ready. Okay, so I'm going to ask, what do you make of the allegation against Samuel Nepa? I'm talking about the accusation from federal government, from Onese Ndibu, and some other people accusing him of uh, sponsoring violent crime in the eastern uh, part of the country. Is he the one sponsoring B B Buku Haram? I said, what do you make of the allegation? What? The allegation is bas baseless. They, they will talk because they don't know where to hold hand against him. Therefore, they lay allegation. What sort of allegation? The allegation is baseless. Forget about that one. Allegation is baseless. Whatever is the sort there is baseless. It's a basket that cannot hold water. Yes. What the federal government and the owners and who serve allegations against someone? It's a basket that cannot hold water. What is? Okay, I tell you the allegation, please. What happened? What happened? What is this? What happened? But are you aware that some time ago Samuel Nepa was invited by friendly police? He was questioned. Are you aware? Question on what? But maybe based on complaint from the Nigerian government. And if I see though, what happened? I think I, I believe they, they, they invite him, they don't arrest him. But not media carried all over the world. Nigerian propaganda is carried all over the world. But you are aware that he was questioned in Finland. He went there and they have personal chat with them. You I see when they are whatever they discuss there, is it made or known? Therefore, I cannot say he was they were questioned for because of uh, the allegation they lay against him or not. Because but he went there to discuss, and whatever they discussed there is not made open. They were not know. But uh, as he went there, what the uh, media has everybody there. Ah, they have arrested him. They they deport him. Ah, it's now in Finland custody. They did this. How many seconds it took him? I feel like they have arrested him. But those boys, people that are following him are his bodyguard. How many seconds it took him to come out again and start his own, his own activities? So that does show that the accusation is baseless. It has nothing to do. A basket that cannot hold water. A broken pot, a broken pot that cannot be useful again. That's what the allegation stands for. I think I'm going to say thank you for your time, Mr. Opala. I think this is a good place to let it go. Thank you very much, Mr. Opala. This is Satellite Media, and I am Mr. Machu. Thank you very much, Mr. Opala. And the boy, Ekenen Mono, on a new one, I have been fed to one night ago, because we were so much up for gas in Iraq. And if you were to go back to my country, I would have been fed. I'm going to be the one to be the one to be the one to be the one to be na o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o o
where the bed here the people of Biafra. Also the key Biabo, um, key few of the Kuba stomach here beef, and then the Gasquaya Bonkawa, Kaya beef is wed, and the man like Kuno, Tia Long Kuno, Itia Long Kuno, Niruakupo, Kamadi Funuchello, Bastama Kaya beef and their Nine, eh, uh, Unu Niruakono Bosinketa. Also the key Biabo to Saya Bosi, eh, uh, called the two Munayaka, Bako Dimpa. Okay, and a mebuka ka ibo. Male baino. Makonya jurada jewe. Only na ya jugundi bona Nigeria. O wole na na o wole o wole na Nigeria ne me biyama zina likanu me. But see, met hala di damelia. Uboho melia. I pray the disease dia. I book out the disease yo. No pardon. Okay, asa doko ubo melo. Unko melo. Tampolo. Eh eh me o me kwelo. Why is an Igbo man case difference. Oh, ah, don't you can't pull on Igbo. Igbo man is here. Nti, no, 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 but sing it. Why an Igbo man difference? Zara me a beef difference. But come back here, man. You go go. Ode ko wolo, ode ko wolo je. Abola ase. Moge zoku. I go no wa ye zoku. Abola ndi ibase. No bada abu Nigeria. In me chayi kote me chayi kote. Mano de reality. So daluli nen. Mr. Sarai, can